Good morning, everyone. Welcome to Vlogmas Day 12. All the happy smiles and the wishes And I want it all from the lights to the mistletoe Tell me one thing Is there anything that you're missing? I will keep you warm as soon as you remove that snow Whatever we do, we will be alright These holiday wonders will open your mind May all your wishes tonight come true The love I live, the dream I knew This Christmas I only wanna be close to you I don't know if I'm in focus because the lighting is so bad right now. It is around five o'clock. I am on my way home from work. Today was a fine day. It wasn't great. It was just meh, which is totally fine. We all have those days. Um, I think the reason why is like, I'm just feeling really tired. And because I'm going to be taking so much time off at the end of this week, I'm trying to get so much done that I'm just like mentally fried and my to-do list is running in my head the whole time, so I'm like struggling to sleep because I can't turn off my mind. But it was a fun, it was, it was an A-OK -okay day. I have nothing to complain about. Life is great. I am blessed. It's wonderful. I'm just feeling a little, ugh. But we're halfway through Vlogmas, which thrilled me beyond belief that I can work my 12 to 13 hour day and still get a daily vlog up every single day. And they have been like of decent quality and of decent length and content. Um, so that makes me really, really happy. After Vlogmas, I will be taking like a solid week off of like no videos because I just need a second to breathe. Did you kill the Roomba? What'd you do? Did you hurt him? What'd you do? What'd you do to Roomba? Before we open up advent calendars, I thought I'd show you what a colleague got me today um, because I think it's a really good gift idea. Um, so let me go ahead and show you. It is this stunning marble tray from William Sonoma. And Stephen and I's last names start with an S. So it has this S in like this rose gold copper color, like inlaid in the marble. It's just so beautiful. Um, I really love it. So that's like a really great gift. What I could imagine doing with this is like to get them like a little cheese cutlery set and like maybe like a gift card to like a cheese shop or a dairy. Um, it'd be a really cute gift. I love it. I love it. I just need to figure out where I'm gonna put it now. 
This is just white cotton string because I have a DIY coming up on Friday's vlog if everything gets delivered, either Friday or Saturday. Um, that's going over the kitchen window. I think it's gonna be really, really cute. Excited about it. This is the puzzle I picked. I think it's really cute. I'm really excited to do it in honor of my grandmother. So we're gonna put together a puzzle and I think it's really adorable. That's what I got in the mail today. Let's go ahead and open our advent calendars for day 12, which I think for the lush 12 days of Christmas, the 12th day has to be coming up. It would be Thursday. Is that right? Then we'll have all five advent calendars to open. All right, let's go check out what we got today. Okay, day 12 of rituals. What do you have for us? Tis the season for scrub. Give yourself the ultimate present with the mild sugar-based exfoliant and rejuvenate your skin. So this is the Rituals Celebrate Each Day Softening Rice Scrub. Ooh. Day 12 of David's Teas. What flavor do we have? Oops, I dropped it. Let's go ahead and slide that in there. And today we got Coffee Pure. Day 12 right here. Centel Carmen. I am so stuffed up that I can't even smell that. It's going to be a candle. It's Ode. This is a great candle. It has like a smoky, if you know odes, this is like a classic ode with a little bit of smoke. So great. I really have so many candles to burn. I'm really falling behind. But I just cannot get over the size of the Rituals samples. I know I mention it every day of Vlogmas when I open the Rituals, but I feel like it deserves repeating. The sample sizes are so big. All right, so need to toss this. Steven said he's going to be late tonight. So, it'll be me and the bubs. Me and the bubs for a while, right? Just you and me for a little bit? I need to put this back. It needs to go in the coat closet. P.S. I know I've never showed this room to you guys. This is our enormous, ridiculously big coat closet. Um, it's like a coat closet for a family of a dozen, like the Partridge family. Um, that is where my bag goes every day. You see that I took off my boots and my feet were wet and I put them up there. Then we have like this little cute cabinet in here. And then this is how I organize a bunch of stuff. So I bought these gold bins at Target a while ago and then I have them each labeled. So this is like different tapes. These are things for walking. This is Bubba's bin. Then I have like pillar candles, jar candles, tea lights, more jar candles. These are melts, these are pillars. Yeah, you just keep everything organized. And then up here is just like, there's some cute little things. That is last year's diptee calendar. And then I have like these alternating baskets that just house like reusable grocery bags and stuff. And then all of our coats over there. And then like this really cute, I painted this wall with like a chalkboard paint and then just have this really cool print to tie the yellow front, the yellow cabinet over here. And then the zebra bowl is just like a catch-all for like keys or anything. But that's our little coat closet. Now I am going to go ahead and do what I do every day, which is watch the view. And then I will pick this back up and talk to you in a little bit. Steven is home. We had dinner. It was really simple. We just had spaghetti. And now I'm watching the news and the results of the Alabama election. I actually look not watching the results yet. They're still talking about it. The polls close in 45 minutes. I am a big politics nerd. Like I DVR debates and 
I stay up late on election nights and it's like just a thing that I love. I'm pretty exhausted. I fell asleep while trying to edit the vlog. I like kept dozing off and closing my eyes. Um, so I'm just trying to stay awake and figure out um, what else to add to this vlog because I don't know. I am so tired that I am going to take a bath and relax and try to get some sleep tonight. I started the book, Mr. Dickens and His Carol. I love it. It's so good. I'm probably 50 pages in and I'm hooked. So I'll be reading this. But I do want to share a couple things that I'm really loving. This, my friends, is called a Dupuff. A friend gave it to me as part of my Christmas gift and I am in love with it. It is really hard right now, but you submerge it in water, it gets really soft, and then you use it as like an exfoliant. You can put cleanser on it. I've been putting a little bit of the Aesop cleanser, and then you hang it back up to dry and it gets hard again. Then you repeat the process. I am loving it. It is so wonderful. You can get them on Amazon. They're super cheap. Do puff, D-E-W-P-U-F-F. -F. And it is a great, great thing. It'd be an awesome, awesome stocking stuffer this year for people. Another thing that I'm loving, which I think would be such a great gift to give, is the Animal Cracker Philosophy Body Wash Bubble Bath. It's kind of everything in one. And I love it. It really does smell like a frosted animal cracker. Those are two things that I think would make awesome gifts this year. And then lastly, I have finally dug into the Pottery Barn Holiday Spice Bath Salt. If you want your bathtub to smell like Christmas, this stuff is amazing. And they have bath bombs as well. I showed them in my Vlogmas. This stuff is great. I cannot find it online, so you have to go to a Pottery Barn to pick it up. But it smells like cinnamon and clove and spice. The bath bomb's the same. So that's gonna be my evening, my friends. I'm going to take a bath. I am going to relax. I am going to fall asleep and get a great sleep. And I am going to leave this like I leave all of them. Take care of yourself, take care of others, and be kind. Kindness is free. Give it to everyone. Until next time, my friends. Bye-bye.